called 112. Hey you guys, welcome back to the channel. We're gonna kick this one off with, you probably could have guessed it, a Target run. If it seems like I'm in here often, it's because I am. It is literally right up the street. Today, we're in here for a quick shop for my shower routine. Okay, here is your first hint. I already have some lotion. So, the next thing I'm gonna see if they have is the Saltair Citrus Body Wash. I know they don't sell the body oils in here. You have to order those. Um, I'm gonna see if they have it. They have it. Also, give me this one. Because it smells, the oil smells good, so I know this smells good. I'll mix these with my lumen. Okay, so I got a new perfume oil that doesn't go along with citrus, but y'all, it smells so good. It is by the French Shade brand, and it's the Unwind and Rest Lavender Cloud Glow On Perfume. I already love the fall scent they had. Um, I can't think of the, the scent. It's like warm vanilla. But that right there. Put some on my hand. It smells so good. It's such a clean scent. Lavender, obviously. Oh, but that smells so good. Only one I don't like is the one that has like, I think it's called bergamot. I don't know how you pronounce that word. But that one I didn't like. That's the only one. But the one vanilla and this lavender one, they smell so good. They smell so good mixed with probably anything. Yeah, let me get out of here. Okay, I also want Put something on the kitchen table, some kind of Christmas, I don't know, some kind of Christmas uh, tray arrangement, something like that. And then I want to see if I can find something for the open space above the fireplace. And that's so I'm running in hundreds to see what I can see. Probably need to get a basket just in case I find something. Okay. Find something. Oh, these baskets suck. Here we go. Okay, so I think I found something. It's $130, but I think it's perfect. I think it goes along with some pictures that we... No, I'm not. Yeah, sure. Thank you. I think I found it. Matches. It's dangerous when you get some photos that you already have. It's got the teal. But it's not just teal, and it's got like gold and white accents. I think my husband would love it. I think I'm gonna get it. Because I'll be mad if I leave it. And if he doesn't like it, I'll just bring it back. It's that simple, right? Okay, y'all. I had to take a moment for the hair. <laughs> Shout out to my girl, Trina Lachey. These are kinky straight human hair clip-ins. I've had them forever. She colored them for me. She crimped them. Y'all, it's so quick and easy. I love them. Reach out to me if you wanna reach out to her. I don't know if the way I did this is gonna work. We gonna try to get it up there to the counter. Okay, so I got it in. <laughs> Long ways. I just gotta be careful walking out of here. Okay, so I didn't do a haul when I got home for home goods, but here is a gold bowl that I purchased for our keys. There are two like gold ball thingies just for decor. I moved the boxes that were up here down there because the keys were in there. Love it. Here is the 
it's not final, but it's updated. Let me say it that way. And then I bought some ornaments. Oh, this book is by that brand, and it was $19.99. That one was $7.99 and that one was $17 or $16.99. I bought two boxes of these like fluorescent ornaments and I just added those in that bowl. The picture and I think we think it'll go perfect up there. We're going to move that and then see how we like it. Just move some stuff around and then I found this old bowl. My daughter washed it out <laughs> and I asked her to put these because I bought two boxes of these fluorescent balls. Um, so I asked her to put these in there and as you can see, it is not enough and she seems to like the uh, <laughs> bird's nest look, but yeah, I'm not feeling that. <clears throat> I'm gonna have to get some more ornaments. I may get some different ones to mix in with that, but that is everything. If that picture does not work up there, I think we're gonna put it here. Um, we're getting a new table, so pay that no mind. Um, <clears throat> but I think we will end up putting it there if it doesn't work here. So. And this is the box that the ornaments came in. It's the Tinsel and Fur brand. And they were $9.99. So, and I got two of those. Okay, y'all, we finally got to the good part. This is the cast of my Tropical Citrus Shower Routine. I don't care what the season is. I'm going to smell how I want to smell. And right now, this is what I want to smell like. So, here we go. Here's just a view of what is in my shower caddy. And a look at some of the other products that I picked up. First thing I'm going to do is drop this shower fizzy and get the aromatherapy going. I always start with my face in this herbal face food soap and then I rub the rest into my hands because it helps my eczema. Then I use these to actually clean my face. I like to double cleanse and I use this down below, only takes a little. And then I use the citrus for the rest of my body. I use a generous portion of that, rub it in. As you can see, it gives a really good lather and when you rinse, your skin should feel squeaky clean. Randomly picked this up one day when they were out of the wash that I was using. I absolutely love it Next up is the Dove Beauty Bar. I use this to put moisture back into my skin And this is the only time I use a washcloth. I only use it on my body Once I'm done washing the rest of my body I add a little more of that Dr. Bronner's to my towel and I clean my bottom area Okay, y'all, we in my favorite part of the shower, the smell good part. I start with the Lumi. See how good that lathers up. It smells so good, y'all. Then next, I went with the Shea Moisture Scrub. And what I did was I added in some of the salt hair to kind of um, give it a more milky texture, smoother texture to rub in. And then I used this loofah, which I don't use often i just got it because it was orange and it matched the color theme <laughs> but anyway rinse that off good and then the last thing i do is go in with a body oil rub it in quick rinse and then i get out and i blot dry pro tip wipe your bottom out with some witch hazel we're gonna keep layering it on y'all up next is the lumi deodorant if you know you know just a little bit of this goes at the top of your gluteal cleft Next up is the Clean Tangerine Lotion, which you can only order online. It is not in stores. Yeah. <laughs> and last but not least, the Bootsy Colada Oil, my fave. Okay, so real quick, I wanted to show y'all two new makeup finds that I'm obsessed with. First of all, 
super cheap but fantastic wet and wild eyebrow pencil one end is the pencil goes up and down and the other end is a brush Y'all, this brush right here, the best. Like, I'm just, cause I'm rushing. We're about to head out to go to dinner um, with my dad and my bonus mom to celebrate my daughter because she finished high school yesterday. So anyway, I want to show y'all this and I had to change the kind of mascara I was wearing because it was smearing onto my contact lenses. And that is extremely, extremely annoying. Putting the top back on this glue because one of my nails came off. But anyway, so I looked and they had the same kind, but. And I'm sharing it because I used it for a couple of days and I love it. It's perfect and it does what the regular Sky High does. It just doesn't run or smear or whatever. So run, don't walk if you are looking for a waterproof mascara. So I'm gonna get this stuff um, put on, show y'all my super, like super casual outfit. Um, and then we're headed out the door. And the color I have is deep brown. And I'm just doing a basic feeling just to look normal. <laughs> Cause this one is really bad in comparison to this one, and I need to go get them done too. This just helps get a sister through. Till then, just do that. Take the brush, just brush it out a little more. And that's it for this. Just making it look like I have brows and lashes. <laughs> I'm not going like super detailed here. Just a little something. Just a little something. And it also comes off and washes off easily so 10 out of 10 for this Maybelline Sky High Lash Sensational Waterproof. So I'm gonna get up and show y'all my feet real quick. And then we're out. Put on a little more. Still feel a little dry. All right, so here's the fit. Nothing spectacular, just my little sweatshirt. This is from Shein. It says Los Angeles, USA. I have on my old little Tiffany heart necklace, just some little small hoops. Um, and I got on just a few little bracelets. Um, the Kendra Scott line from Target and just a diamond tennis bracelet. These jeans from Target, this is the American Thread brand that I love with a little, uh, what's the name, what do you call this rip situation going on? And I got them cuffed there at the bottom. And then I have on these old, really old Nikes, but I still love them because it matches the pink in my sweatshirt. And I just love pink, but you know, there's the super duper, casual fit for the night. Excited to be chauffeur this evening.
four. Yeah. No, they're called 112. <laughs> she had Grand Grand, she hadn't done any videos lately with the <laughs> 